dry immediately. Um, kind of thirsty. <sighs> yeah. What's up, guys? It's Emma. Welcome back. That felt weird. Anyways, shut the fuck up. I'm literally so annoyed right now. Hi. So, what's up, guys? It's Emma. You know me. You probably don't like me that much, but you probably like me a little bit because that's why you're here. I'm pretty excited for today's video. I mean, I'm excited for every video, right? I mean, right. We're always excited here in this family, but especially this one because today we're eating big and no pun intended. <laughs> <laughs> this video is gonna be pretty extreme. I mean like not gonna lie might get like 1 billion views. Gangnam style Move out of the fucking way, baby. Because <laughs> this video is going to be fucking crazy. So as you guys know, I have kind of an obsession with whisks. It all started with the mini whisk. Hold on. Mini whisk, right? You know, one day I used her and she was just something else and stole my heart. Of course, I also have a regular whisk, but we don't really give a fuck about her. <laughs> um, anyways. Well, then somebody had the nerve to send this to my PO box. Hold on. This bitch, right? I mean, she doesn't do anything at all, but she's cute though, right? Okay, well, then I was sent this whisk. Yeah, it gets smaller. Like, who would have thought? I mean, you guys, I don't know where your, like, whisk dealer is, but you guys got all the goods. And then when you thought it couldn't get any better, look at this. I was also sent an even smaller whisk keychain. The moral of the story is, you guys know I love whisks. You guys have been gifted me with these whisks for the past you know a few months well then one day I'm at the PO box and um I get a box yeah no shit and this box is huge the size of me I mean I'm not that tall but like it's still pretty big for like a box and I was like wow what could be in there I shake the box hmm something's rattling like this is weird like look at this beat I open it up and my life changed forever I was sent this <laughs> Yeah, ever since I was sent this whisk, I knew that I needed to do something and it needed to be big. Then it dawned on me, big whisk makes big food. Yeah, bitch, that's what we're doing today. Today, we're gonna be making the biggest cookie that America has ever seen, and I'm pretty excited about it. I don't know, um, I like it big. So here's my game plan. Actually, do not, you're just gonna follow along. For the type of cookie that we're making today, we're gonna be making chocolate chunk cookies because they're superior to the rest of the cookies. And not only all of that, but these cookies are vegan. So for all my vegan thoughts out there, I got you. <laughs> and for all of the girls who are going to Coachella, these cookies are very healthy and will most likely fit into your very restrictive and mentally draining diet. <laughs> this really works for everyone. <laughs> Good. All right, while I'm doing this, you know, because this part's not interesting, I'm just like putting all the ingredients together and whatnot, so let me tell you a story, right? Sounds good? No? Well, you're gonna hear it anyways, so. I kind of miss that. Cute. This is just something that happened to me today, and I just wanted to share. Also, this outfit, like these leggings with this top, doesn't match at all, but you weren't supposed to see the bottom half of my body, and now that you did, it's like awkward. Sorry. Anyways, a little while ago, I tweeted that I saw some beautiful creature of a man. Well, actually a boy. I mean, he's like my age, but at Whole Foods, or that's the location I said on Twitter because I didn't want to actually say where I saw him just in case for some reason he saw the tweet somehow, which he would never see the tweet, but like just in case he did, like, like I, I just, I, I, I would die. Sorry. One of those things where it's like, you see him, and then you're like, wow, he's so beautiful. And then you're like, well, never gonna see him again. Well, guess what? I fucking saw him again today. I saw him again. He's, okay, I'm sorry. My luck is bad. Every day I have bad luck. The universe is testing me at all times. So the fact that I saw him twice, by the way, this is palm shortening. I don't know what that is, and I like don't wanna know, but I just thought I'd let you know because it probably looks concerning, and I just wanted to kind of run it by you guys to see what you thought. But anyway, back to the story. I couldn't believe that I saw him again. We walked right by each other, made eye contact, and it was magical for only me, not for him. He's probably like, this bitch is ugly. But I, I loved it though. But I didn't say anything to him. I look back at this and I'm like, Emma, you are so stupid. But then again, if you think about it, like what would I have said? Hey, <laughs> like what the fuck, you know what I mean? And the thing is, he could be a total asshole. What if he's like a total dick? What if he cheats on his girlfriends? Like, we don't know. When you just look at someone, you don't know what they're like. This guy could be literally Satan himself and I would have no clue because all I know about him is that I looked at him and that he's really tan, blonde, my type, my dream man, really. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so if you know who you are, slide into the DMs. And also, to make matters
Potter's worse. No one believes me. I tweeted about it again. Some people were like, um, Pixar didn't happen. Bitch, you think I'm gonna take a picture of this hoe? Sorry, I'm probably being really loud. My neighbors probably don't wanna hear about my life, so. But also I saw him and my hair is like this. This is what my hair looked like when I saw him. You know what I mean? What a first impression. I really f***ed it up for myself. Whatever, you guys don't care. This is like really weird ingredients because it's like really vegan. I like to be inclusive to all, so I like to make my recipes that I make vegan. Hate on me if you want, but really won't be hating on me. That's for damn sure. Ah, no, what the f***? Why does that shit happen to me? It's like, it's rude. It really is. And I don't deserve it at all. I am so nice to everyone. Well, not everyone. Ugh. Ow. So, St. Patty's Day coming up. <laughs> I literally could not give less fucks about St. Patrick's Day. And do you know what? To all you Irish people out there who are about to get offended, I'm Irish too, so shut the f*** up. I've also been to Ireland, so shut the f*** up times two. I don't care about St. Patty's. It's not a fun holiday. There's no point. Actually, there probably is a point. I just don't know what it is because I'm an uncultured swine. This is so fucking fun. Why is this low-key like effective? Like it's actually good at mixing. I hope you understand. Honestly, I kind of sound like Britney right there. Understand. Do you know what? F this. I'm sick of it. Kind of worked honestly, but I'm sick of it. It's making my arm tired. So guess what? We're gonna bring out. Take a hot look at this. Someone else sent me in my PO box a fucking hand mixer because y'all know that my arms are weak as fuck. And so you sent me a hand mixer so that I would be able to- Oh wait, shit, now I have to wash it. That's annoying. Y'all sent me a hand mixer. Y'all, never said that in my life. Don't ever want to say it again. Y'all, why did I- It's tempting. I can't stop. You guys sent me a hand mixer because you knew that I needed it. I don't want to have to wash that, so I'm going to use a different hand mixer. Because guess what? I wasn't just sent one hand mixer. I was sent two. A hand mixer that requires no electricity so that if I ever needed to mix stuff when there's no electricity, I would have this. And I just want to say shout out to you. It's like Christmas every day with you guys being my Santa. I love you. <laughs> I want to die a little bit. I'm gonna use this one because it'll be easier to wash. You know what I mean? I have to think about myself sometimes. Look at this bad boy. Just washed it. Let's get right into this. Ugh. Ew. That looks like literal taco meat. Holy shit, that does look like taco meat. I'm vegetarian. I wouldn't know actually anyways. I hate this. It's difficult. Okay. I don't even want to look. I'm fucking tired. If these cookies don't turn out well and I put this much manual labor into it, I'm gonna be so fucking pissed. Why does this look like chicken? This is supposed to be vegan. I think I've said that exact same phrase in another video. I can't remember, but I feel like I did. Sorry that I literally have only like 10 jokes and I just like regurgitate them. That's something that you signed up for. I didn't tell you to do that. Get crazy, get wild, let's party, get wild. If you wanna have fun, do come. If you didn't watch Jersey Shore, you won't get that reference. And honestly, you don't deserve to get the reference if you didn't watch Jersey Shore because Jersey Shore was genuinely the best show and I don't know, people who didn't watch it just didn't have a childhood. I was literally 12 and I would just watch the people on Jersey Shore have sex. I think it's funny that like some people maybe potentially clicked on this video expecting like instructions on how to make cookies like that would be so funny because I would never do that. Where's the salt? God damn it Where the fuck is it though honestly, I literally just had it like I don't know where it went I literally don't understand <laughs> uh, Are you fucking it's this it's okay yay yay Hi. <laughs> Stop staring at me. I love how messy I make the kitchen and then make my mom clean it up. It's so cute how I do that. Okay, this is low-key working really well. Okay, well, I need an apron. Why don't I have an apron? That's so weird. You're not supposed to use this whisk like this, but I clearly don't give a fuck. Okay. Yes! Go off clean. <laughs> we bring out the big guns. So you know what I'm saying? Let's get into it. Yes! Yes! This works not good. Ow, what the fuck? I'm like breaking my house. You're welcome, mom. <laughs> I know you love me. Oh, oh no. I just broke my cabinet. Oh no, there goes my fridge. <laughs> okay, I'm done with that. That's so sexual. So guys, what's been up? You know, me and you, we haven't talked in a while and I just kind of want to know what's up. Like, has your crush been talking to you at school? Is your best friend being a bitch? She's probably being a bitch. Did you get an A on your test? Did your teacher... 
I don't go to school. Okay, I don't know what kind of paper to use. I haven't even washed my hands yet, and I already made the whole thing. Germs will die in the oven because they can't survive that heat. Am I right, ladies and gents? <laughs> That's a fake fact. I'm washing my hands. Mom, I know you're watching. <coughs> now this is when things get kind of weird. <coughs> this is a fucking nightmare. Holy shit. <coughs> This is our baby. She's fucking huge, and I'll see you in eight to ten minutes. Goodbye. Ah. Holy shit! Oh my god! Look at this. Will, 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 will. Look at this bitch. Look at her. Aww. Let's slice into this bad bitch. Hmm. She feels a little bit liquidy, but we'll work with it. Okay. So, we've taken out a little slice. Um, let's just see how it tastes. I mean, it's not bad. Mm. 